Teams who practice an Agile SDLC will most commonly use Jira for requirement and defect tracking. In this video, I will show you how to best leverage Jira with QTest Manager. First, you'll need to head over to the Atlassian Marketplace and install the QTest for Jira test management app to ease your Jira cloud or server. Once installed, we can now head over to QTest Manager and navigate to the project in which you wish to configure Jira. Within the project settings, we select Integration Settings and then Jira from the left-hand menu. Next, add a Jira connection, specifying the Jira URL and credentials with Jira Admin Access. Test the connection and once successful, hit Save and Configure. From here, we can now specify which Jira issue types we want to map as QTest defects and requirements. I am now adding mapping for QTest bug types to Jira bug issue types within my Jira project. Now I will do the same for the QTest requirements, this time mapping them to Jira story issue types. Once I finish configuring, I will now do a one-time retrieve of the specified data. Once completed, I can find all my Jira user stories imported over to QTest as requirements in the requirements module under the imported from Jira folder. As you can see, all my Jira user stories are listed within this folder, however they are not organised. If you wish to further organise these requirements, you can do so. Head back to the Jira integration settings and click on the spanner for your requirement integration. From this menu, we can specify fields to organise our user stories. In this example, I will first organise by issue type, then by status. Next, click retrieve again. Back in the requirements module, I can now see my requirements from Jira have been organised. From each requirement, you can now see all the values as read-only brought over from Jira, as well as the link back to the original Jira story. After you build out a test case against the requirement, I will now execute the test run and fail the fourth step. From here, I now want to submit a defect back to Jira as a bug. As you can see when submitting a bug, QTest will open a native Jira window and auto-populate the description with the test steps. Once submitted, I will save my test results. Now, from the execution results, I can see a link to my defect over in Jira. If you follow the link to the Jira bug, I can see from within Jira the QTest execution history as well as the original Jira story it was linked to.